Hello everyone, in this video I bring you another UK visa you can explore. I've not talked about this visa at all on my channel, so this visa is new to my channel, though it's not like new to the UK. This visa has been around, but they recently added some updates to this visa. And this is a visa that is not much talked about, though the requirements are quite easy and it's something you can get real quick. As a matter of fact, there is urgency right now in applying for this visa so anyone that applies for this visa right now will probably get a decision in a matter of days i know someone who got this visa under six days and that is why i am making this video so everyone out there that wants to migrate to the uk on this pathway can apply for the visa immediately on this visa you don't need the ielts there is no English language requirement for this visa at all. So if you're interested in this pathway, then do watch this video to the end. I'm going to be giving you all the information you need about this visa. If we are just meeting, my name is Jackie and you're welcome to my channel where I share content to help you migrate abroad, to study, to work and to live. My mission on this channel is to help you improve your quality of life by opening your mind to opportunities that exist for you abroad. If this is something you're interested interested in then do subscribe to my channel and maybe turn on the post notifications so you know every time I post a new video right now on my channel I have videos on how to migrate to so many countries like the UK Netherlands Ireland Japan Australia Portugal Sweden so many countries so you may want to check my old videos so you can know your options and to my returning subscribers I want to especially thank you and appreciate you for all the support thank you for always watching my videos I see your likes I see your comments and your shares too thank you so much for the support I do appreciate it now if you're a new subscriber like you subscribe to my channel within the last week let me know in the comments so I can welcome you specially to the channel thank you so much for for your support. All right, like I said, this is not a totally new visa. It's been around, but it's not much talked about and the uk government made some changes to this visa in the latest updates to the immigration rule and there is quite an urgency for people to apply for this particular visa the name of the visa is the seasonal worker visa all the information i'll be giving you in this video about this visa is gotten directly from the uk government website so you can go check it out yourself later to see more so what is the seasonal worker visa as the name implies this is a visa that is given to foreign workers to come to the uk for seasonal work it is a temporary work visa you can apply for a seasonal worker visa to come to the UK and work in horticulture for up to six months. For example, picking fruits and vegetables or flowers. And you can also use this visa to come to the UK to work in poultry. You need to apply for poultry seasonal worker visas by 15th November each year. So there are two categories of work that is eligible for the seasonal worker visa. One is horticulture, which is garden cultivation and management. So it is work in agriculture that has to do with fruit picking, tending to the farm, managing, you know, the farm and things that border around that. And the second category is the poultry work. So this poultry work was recently introduced to the seasonal worker visa in the last immigration update of October 18. And for the poultry work, this is quite urgent because they need the seasonal workers to come into the UK to work against the Christmas holiday. Because during the Christmas holiday, a lot of poultry is needed and there's usually shortage in producing enough poultry to go around. And the work in the poultry row was open on the 18th of October and it will expire on the 31st of December. 
and to apply for this visa the deadline is the 15th of november so for this poultry work alone you will be required to leave the uk by 31st december but for horticulture our applications is open all year round you can make it into the uk all year round to work in horticulture on the seasonal worker visa and for that one you can stay in the uk for up to six months so anytime in the year at all, if you're moving on any role that is in horticulture, you can apply for that visa all year round. But for roles in poultry, you must apply for that by 15th November of every year. So what are the things you need to apply for this seasonal worker visa? The first thing you need is to have a sponsor. So you have to have a job offer and your employer will provide the certificate of sponsorship that is a COS which you will use to apply for the visa. So having a sponsor is mandatory for this visa. And the second thing you need to do is to meet other eligibility requirements and I'll quickly run through these requirements for you. So the first First thing is you must be 18 years of age or over when you apply and have both of the following one is the COS I earlier mentioned from your UK sponsor and the number two thing is enough money to support yourself in the UK you usually need to have at least 1270 pounds available unless you are exempt you're exempt if your employer is taking care of that completely so about your certificate of sponsorship so someone may be wondering what is certificate of sponsorship i get this question a lot a certificate of sponsorship is a reference number which holds information about the job and your personal details it is not an actual certificate or a paper document your sponsor will give you your certificate of sponsorship reference number so basically this is only a number that your sponsor will be giving to you and you need to add this number to your visa application form you can only use your certificate of sponsorship reference number only once and your certificate of sponsorship is valid for three months from the date it's assigned to you so from the date you receive your cos you have three months to apply for your visa or it's going to be invalid so let's talk about money to support yourself you must have at least 1270 pounds in your bank account to show you can support yourself in the uk you will need to have had the money available for at least 28 days in a row day 28 must be within 31 days of applying for this visa you usually need to show proof of this when you apply unless your sponsor can cover your costs during your first month in the uk which is up to 1000 270 pounds so if your sponsor can support you and you don't need this proof of funds your certificate or sponsorship must confirm this so let's talk about how long it takes you can apply for a visa up to three months before the day you are due to start work in the uk the date is listed on your certificate of sponsorship as part of your application you need to prove your identity and provide your documents you may need to allow extra time if you need an appointment to do this you find out if you need one when you start your application so about getting a decision on this visa once you've applied online proved your identity and provided your documents you usually get a decision on your visa within three weeks so how much does this visa cost the application fee for this seasonal worker visa is 259 pounds how long can you stay in the uk on this seasonal worker visa you can stay in the uk for up to six months if you're working in horticulture and if you're working in poultry you have from 18th october to 31st december to stay in the uk so what can you do in the uk on this seasonal worker visa you can work in the job described in your certificate of sponsorship and something else you can do on this visa is to study yes you can study in the uk while you're on this visa now over to what you cannot do in the uk on this visa you can't take a permanent job you cannot work in a second job or a job that is not described in your certificate of sponsorship and you cannot get public funds and you cannot bring family members with you so on this visa you travel by yourself to the uk you cannot take your dependents with you so this is a temporary stay visa in the uk at the end of your visa duration you need to return to your country 
you may be thinking the time is too short six months in the uk is too short for you but if you're open to this if you feel like you just want to explore like just travel for a while you can go on this visa and you know there are opportunities for you when you're in the uk you can use your time in the uk to search for a permanent job there are jobs that you're more likely to get when you're in the uk than when you're outside the uk so you can use your time on this seasonal worker visa to scout for a permanent job and then when you get your offer you get your cos you can just travel down to your country and apply for your visa to return to the uk well obviously this is an worker visa is not for everybody but if you think it works for you somehow then you can take advantage of it the call for applications for roles in poultry is very urgent the application closes on the 15th of november so you need to act real fast if you want to take advantage of this opportunity so let me know in the comments if you're interested in this and i can and do another video to show you where to get jobs for this if you found this video valuable do give it a like and um share it with others let them take advantage of this and um thank you for watching i will see you in my next video